Forget your cape heroes and austere prestige dramas, the most auspicious franchise season is here again. The Fast Saga has blessed us with a trailer for its latest iteration, the ninth Fast and Furious film, aptly titled F9. There's more to the trailer than meets the eye. It's impossible to talk about the F9 trailer and not talk about Han Lu. If you're a casual viewer of the Fast and Furious franchise or you're still catching up on it, you might need some context. The end of the trailer features a Korean man walking in and munching on a snack. That would be Han Lu, played by Sung Kang, who has presumably been recovering from getting killed in an earlier movie. Han is at the center of a mildly confusing timeline shift that the Fast and Furious franchise made as it was hitting the metaphorical NOS button. The character was introduced and subsequently died in what appears to be a street racing crash during 2006's Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift. But Han's presence proved to be so beloved by fans that the character was included in the fourth, fifth, and sixth films. The canonical timeline was rearranged so that Tokyo Drift actually takes place after the events of Fast and Furious 6. The mid-credits scene of Fast 6 shows the exact scene from Tokyo Drift in which Han dies, but reveals the crash to be an intentional act by Deckard Shaw. Since Han's death and the later rehabilitation of Deckard as a good guy, the hashtag Justice for Han became popular online for two reasons. One, the character is deeply missed, and two, because it's more than a little unfair that his killer is now buddy-buddy with Team Dom. Justice is coming, according to the trailer, and we couldn't be more excited. We couldn't be happier to see that Helen Mirren is reprising her role as Magdalene Shaw once again after the character first appeared in Fate of the Furious and then cameoed in Hobbs and Shaw. If you missed her most recent appearance in Hobbs and Shaw, you might not know that Magdalene was sprung out of prison by Deckard and Hattie, two of her three children. Unfortunately, due to the productions of Hobbs and Shaw and F9 overlapping, neither Deckard nor Hattie will be joining the team in F9. Their new best friend forever, Dwayne Johnson's Luke Hobbs, will likewise not be appearing in F9. Owen Shaw, however, might be a different story. Originally the major antagonist of F6, Owen ended up in a hospital after Dom's crew did a number on him. That stay in the hospital was what originally motivated Big Brother Deckard to kill Han and swear vengeance on Dom's family, before ultimately breaking bread with them in Fate of the Furious. The writers for Fast and Furious 9 have obliquely teased that Owen might be ready to rumble again beyond his brief cameo in Fate of the Furious, though they didn't specify when. It's entirely possible he'll skip ahead to appear in Fast and the Furious 10 instead, which is already in pre-production. Still, his possible appearance is something to keep in mind as the story revs up. As the F9 trailer reveals, Dom and Mia Toretto have a secret brother now, Jacob. In fact, director Justin Lin is returning to the franchise after sitting out for the 7th and 8th films precisely because he wanted to invert the trope of found family in the Fast and Furious franchise. As he told Entertainment Weekly, when I left after Fast 6, I really thought that was it, like, there's no more Fast stories I can tell. Then, two years ago, I woke up with an idea for the new chapter, and a big part of that is exploring the steam of family that is always tied to Fast, but doing it through blood. You don't turn your back on family. Even when they do. Given all the new familial surprises in F9, it looks like there's never been a better time for Dom's sister Mia Toretto to make a full return to the front lines of the Fast franchise. We last saw Mia in action back in Fast and Furious 6, but she took a backseat in Furious 7 due to her second pregnancy. Rather than battle super spies, she stayed in the Dominican Republic while the rest of the family drove cars through skyscrapers. Things became complicated following the sudden and tragic death of Paul Walker in 2013, halfway through production of Furious 7. An entire coda was added to the end of the film to celebrate Walker's life through his character Brian and his relationship to Mia as part of the overarching story. Since Mia's character is so entwined with Brian, she didn't appear in Fate of the Furious under the guise of the two wanting a quieter, safer life with their children. The entire franchise has had a period of readjustment since Walker's loss, and Mia's place within canon represents the biggest challenge of all. How do you write around the fact that Mia gets to go on big, superheroic car adventures and Brian doesn't? Apparently, the answer involves giving her and Dom a secret thief-slash-assassin brother played by John Cena. This bombastic trailer has plenty of details to pour over, but it's definitely not revealing everything. For one thing, Michael Rooker is nowhere to be found. The veteran character actor was confirmed to be joining the cast way back in August 2019. It's odd that a character enjoying a nice career high thanks to the Marvel Cinematic Universe wasn't featured in a trailer for another massive franchise. All we know for certain is that his character's name is Buddy, and that Rooker was cast in the last minute as production was set to begin. Considering the timing, it's possible he replaced an actor whose availability suddenly fell through. From there, we can only speculate. Will he be playing Dom, Mia, and Jacob's father? 
some sort of new henchman to Charlize Theron's villainous cipher? Or maybe he'll simply be a helpful car mechanic to get the Fast family back on the road. One thing's for sure, though. You ever heard the saying, the enemy of my enemy is my friend? I don't have friends. I got family. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Looper videos about your favorite movies and TV shows are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.